Hi guys, welcome back to another video. You know I like to start my videos off with a bang. We had this incredible project that our very important client asked us to put together. He wanted a tennis necklace of tennis necklaces. So we put together, every diamond is two carat, every diamond is DEF only, every diamond is flawless to BBS2, every diamond is GIA individually certified with the laser inscription on GIA number on the diamond, Every diamond is triple excellent, no fluorescence. You can't get better. This is unbelievable. 24 inches long, all handmade in platinum. So excited to get into the client's hands. This was a major project, took three months to make. Really excited to have this opportunity. You know, videos and pictures don't do any justice to how beautiful this really is. When you see it in person, up close, you hold it and touch it, it's amazing. We had Dom put it on so you can get a visual of how it falls and the way it's hinged and every stone reflecting the light perfectly and match so well. Truly stunning, honored to have the opportunity to have been able to produce this. And it, it takes um, a lot of work, a lot of talent, a lot of connections to be able to put something like this together. You don't see this in your average store very often. And um, I'm really proud that we had this opportunity to do this for the client. Thank you. I wanted to share with you a fun project that I got the opportunity to complete for a team of cryptocurrency founders of these two coins right here called both Hex and Pulse. The rings are a visual representation of their logos with the Pulse ring being mounted in 18 karat white gold, two and a half point F to G color uh, round diamonds for the Pulse and a magenta color graduating to a indigo blue and the hex ring with those same two and a half point f to g color round diamonds for the hex part of the ring mounted in 18 karat rose gold graduating from a pastel pink to sort of a light canary yellow overall this was a really fun project that started about a year ago with two guys on the team commissioning a set of rings for themselves that ultimately led to the rest of the team taking part as well after seeing the first couple sets in person. So a uh, huge shout out to these guys for giving us the opportunity to create something fun for them. And now the whole team has a matching set of rings. I have some incredible items. We've been on a creative mode. We've been creating a lot of exotic, unique pieces, very difficult. Some of them have been in the works for months and months to match the stones and put it together. As always, everything is GIA certified, so we have the certification to back up what we say it is. We have this incredible necklace here that just is, falls beautifully, made for a princess. We did this incredible necklace here with marquees and cushions. It's long, very sexy the way it falls. Love this necklace. This is three carat each rounds, all GIA, all triple excellent, with the matching bracelet, of course. So they're all certified, all three carat each. Pete, um, Pete, hang, hang that over your wrist for some reference. Let's give everyone some reference here. Come on, guys. Wow. I'll throw the dice in Vegas with this on. Wow. <laughs> Anytime. If you, ever, if you ever see anybody wearing a bracelet like that, you know that the real deal. The, the real deal. We did this incredible cuff, which we had one before that we sold. We decided to make another one. This is just amazing amount of work the way the stones graduate on both ways going down the sides and then this incredible guys this is this is just unbelievable look at this it's a you know 60 carat yellow center stone filled with like another 60 70 carats of round diamonds beautiful it fits like a cuff it's just meant to be tight and just sit right there getting ready for the holidays and then of course we did this beautiful emerald cut necklace. These are all one carat each emerald cuts. Again, all GIA certified, perfectly matched. This is a lot of work. There's hundreds of stones here that we had to match and we handmade it and built it. Looking at, when we're looking at these pieces like this, it's, it's very difficult to get it to match the stone one, you know, from the right to the left and make the symmetry, not only match in color and clarity, but also the graduation. So when we're looking at stuff like this, how long does it take a setter and a jeweler to work together to make these pieces? Like in life, there's different qualities of everything. There's different quality cars, there's different quality leather goods, there's different quality jewelers. Um, it takes an exceptional high quality jeweler to put this together. 
every setting, you know, some of these pieces have hundreds of stones. Every setting has to be handmade and then attached. And when it's a necklace, it has to be attached so that it conforms to the body. So it has to move this way, it has to move this way. Now, for example, this emerald cut necklace, it has a couple hundred stones. The true meaning of a fine necklace is that every length and width millimeter, every table, every girdle, the way it faces up, everything matches perfectly. Anybody could throw 200 stones together, but to have 200 perfectly matched stones is another level. When you look at the round diamond necklace that are three carat each, these takes months and months to gather these stones together. You know, if you want an engagement ring and you want an FVS1, it's one stone. You want an earring, you need a matched pair. You do this necklace and bracelet, we needed 57 stones, where everything is in the parameter of DEF and everything's in the parameter of flawless to VS2. Everything GIA, every single stone triple excellent. It's hard enough to find one diamond that's triple excellent, never mind 57 stones. Everything, every millimeter, table, girdle, everything matches perfectly. That's the true meaning of a fine piece of jewelry. And then it has to form, it has to have movement and flexibility. So these take months and months of work on different levels, from the guy who hand makes the pieces, to the guy that assembles it, to the guy that pre-polishes it, to the guy that sets the stones and then puts the whole thing together. It's, it's a lot, a lot of work. Months and months go into this. And it takes a certain quality shop. And I'm grateful that we have that quality and those standards. Thank you. Hey guys, Peter Martin here. I'm getting mic'd up. I have a special event. I was invited to do the Two Chain show. So Two Chains coming to the store, and we're going to do his show live here at the store. I'm excited about it. Instead of going to the studio and doing it, we wanted to showcase a lot, a lot of jewelry. So it's obviously easy to, to do it here. That's great. I told you. Perfect. You see how, yeah. seriously, look how the puppy pops. Yeah, that's beautiful. They don't dance and sing like that normally. That's that triple excellent. Told you. Yep, I'm very happy. All right. He's great. Okay. Tell him, tell him what you did for this man, Pete. Um, I think we did this in two hours? Two hours, yeah. Two hours. We have a rush engagement going on here. There's a baby on its way. We had to get this out of the way yeah. now. So we picked out a GIA certified round. Last tri second. Triple excellent, last Thank second. You. Mounted it, sized it, everything. And he's got his official paperwork. Done. Perfect. <laughs> did you tell him it's a, a 1.71 triple excellent GIA certified round diamond? That's what it is. Yeah. Right. right <laughs> under, <laughs> under, under 15,000. Absolutely. Quite impressive. Okay. So here's what I want to bring out to you. The so, proof is in the pudding. So first of all, it's important. See, people think of the four C's. Mm -hmm. There's like 15 C's. The quality, the color, clarity, carrot weight. And what are the four C's? Cut is the round. Clarity, color, carrot weight. Those are the four C's. There's a lot more going on here. So first of all, I like the day of the cert, which is new. You always want a new cert. Mm. Okay, number one. Number two, carat 70. Number three, which a lot of guys don't do. See this GIA number? See it says it's, it's a carat 70. Maybe I know. Yeah. Yeah, it's perfect. All right. Honestly, yeah, it's perfect. Uh, you're not allowed to wear it. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> So that's gonna be it for this one guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. As always, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.